All right. We found the gutter that we're going to fish tonight. So we're looking for a couple of these little high bits here so that you can park your car and don't get washed away as the tide comes in. Looking for the inlets and outlets so you can see the, the outlet here. There's the other end of the gutter there. So the fish will come in through the gutter as the tide crashes over that middle sand bank. It'll wash out bits of food, bring in the little fish. So Jeff has decided he's going to chuck a bit of metal. What have you settled on? A Bishop 60. Bishop 60. Andy, what, what are you going to be running? 985. 985. There 985. we go there. 985. That is beautiful. There he goes. And he's jagged a tail up. They're out there though. Beautiful little tailor. Well, it looks like Dave's caught a fish here. Oh, he's on, look at that. Let's see who he's on. Easy. Another one, Andy. He looks like a keeper, eh? For sure. Easy. It's over. How'd you go, Dave? Baited. Baited. What did you catch, Jeffrey? That's nasty. Did you do that on purpose? You've got to be a better size about him, mate. Here we are, got our new spot, so a new gutter, you can see the gutter, here's the channel coming in, sand bank in the back there, we're going to fish the channel tonight, I've got a good feeling, I picked this spot out myself, Jeff I said we'll get nothing there, oh now you back me up, so I've picked this spot, it's going to be pretty windy, I reckon the wind noise might be a bit ugly, Andy, oh look Andy's asleep again, <laughs> Wake up, Andy! This is it, tonight's mission. This gutter straight in front of us. Big, low tide gutter. We'll fill up with water at high tide. And we're actually going to be fishing this narrow green section just here. So last night, heading home, we come across a couple of blokes who were catching jewies here. And uh, they got some beauties. Right in this dark green section in front of us. Dave's onto something sizable here by the looks of it. Hard to see his rod bend. It's 20 past 9 at night and we're chasing Dewey's. We'll see what he gets. Oh, Dave! Look at that!
Nice fish, mate. Nice one, mate. Hold him up. Beautiful. Turn your light off. Hang on. Wow, that's a nice fish, man. Well over. Nice work, Dave. Yep. He's 85. Well, Dave, not a bad night's fishing, not a bad morning cry vacking. Spectacular. That's what Fraser's is about. Having a haul. Jewfish. Beautiful. Taking home dinner for the kitties. It's Jewfish kitties. No tailor. Dave, it's quick. Okay. Now, we're having a bit of a shark fish. Andy's, where, where do you reckon Andy is? And he's asleep in the car. There he is back there, 15 hours a day. So what's the plan for tonight? That's, <laughs> that's a question for you, Jeff. Yeah? Yeah. Well, we've come back to the Dewey spot where we caught some fish last night and we're gonna try and catch some more. Who, who caught fish last night? <laughs> you oh, and Andy. That'd be me. Right, eh? Catch a shark, Leon's depending on you. David's on again, it's just after dark. Um, we're just sitting there having a beer and Dave's rod went, so we'll see what it is. Stingray. Oh well, better than nothing. And he's on. Got something half decent, calling it a dewy straight up. It's kicking and fighting well. No, right. it's all about the video. Don't worry about your fish. Turn it off. It's got to be just here. <laughs> That's a keeper for sure. For sure. Pick him up, Andy. Yeah, turn him on his side a bit. Light him up, Dave. Andy. Nice fish, mate. Well done. He'd be 85. Nice one, Andy. Right, Dave's on. It's now about 7:30. A little while after Andy picked his up. It's a dewy, but not a big one. Only a little one. Yeah. He's a keeper, I reckon.
What do you got to say, Dave? He's beautiful, but he swallowed the hook. He's about 85 as well. I'm not going to get it out. Righto, Dave's on again. I can't see the line, Jeff. Might be just. Let him go, Dave, he's off. Okay, we've got Andy. I think he's going to spill me. No, he won't. What happened? Oh, we had a shark. Hi, Jeffrey. <laughs> We'd like to talk to you about the fish that you lost. What happened there? Um, not much. I lost it. Two fish? I, one would assume so. Over a metre, probably. <laughs> no. Well, we didn't catch it. You can say it was over that a metre. It's really bright, eh? Hey? It's not even in your face. <laughs> Mojo. So, you're not let go again. Look, I've failed. I have failed. I've not caught a keeper, Dewey. Like you two blokes. Yeah. What do you mean? Oh, let's have a look at. Oh, that's right. Oh, well. Better luck next time. Well, last morning on the island, decided to come down for a quick fish. Oh, and Dave just had one, but a he little, lost it. A little tail, I reckon it was about 20 centimetres. Another one, David. And, uh, pretty little. Just wait for him to stop flicking over. Yeah. They're not very big. Hey, got one on. Make a call, Jeff. A little tailor, mate. Little tailor. I reckon he's going to be 35. Very little. Well, Dave's just hooked something here. Oh no, it's just a tail. Oh, Trevally. Looks like a baby GT, Dave. They got sharp things. Yep. Generally pick him up, you'll be right. Ranta. better. Okay, Jeffrey's on. What he's got. Nice one, Jeffrey. A monster. Well, you wouldn't believe it, but yes, Dave's caught another one. 
it's not a bad size one for this trip. A bit over 40. Here we have some poor misadventure. Towing the boat through and they've obviously jagged it on its side and bent the A-frame, ripped a wheel off. Well, that's it. End of another Fraser. Don't say that, Jeffrey. Why do you say that? You always say it at the end of the trip. It's nice Jewfish fillets, Taylor fillets. And we've got about the same amount already in the freezer. An epic adventure, I have to say. Good job.